you know, there's only a certain point in which to grow during development. And if you miss that point, then you're going to be stunted for the rest of your life. And that's going to affect your ability to work. It may affect how uh, affected you are by uh, infectious diseases and, and other things as well. When they eat the small fish, they eat the entire fish. That contains all the vitamins, the minerals, all the other good things. And large fish is also for consumption, but mostly we are thinking for income. They can consume some, they can sell a good portion of the large fish for outside, get an income that improves the family livelihood. We targeted specifically very poor women-headed households, and these are women farmers. I think there's good evidence from around the world that if you improve the women's situation, you will improve the whole family's situation, which isn't necessarily true for men. We have a strong nutrition education component. This component actually doing the cooking demonstration, giving education for preparation of the good food for the young children, food for the pregnant women, food for the lactating women. As a result, this small fish introduction is a huge positive response at the community level. They are consuming, they are giving to the young children, 